cookie class for my friend Patty Page. She's made these adorable cookies. They're dog cookies. They're so great. And she's going to show me how to ice them. What's next? All right, well, we're going to take about a quarter of a cup of the thicker royal icing. This is really thick icing. So now I'm just going to add a teaspoon of egg white to thin the icing out. If you wanted to use water, you could do that as well. We're going to start with a quarter teaspoon of egg whites. Of egg whites. Oh, I like that she's going to squeeze things. That's easier to control, isn't it? That's exactly. great. That's really smart. So the consistency I'm looking for here is like the consistency of maple syrup. Oh, so it really just drips it back. It drips back in and it kind of disappears into what was already in the bowl. Then you pretty much know you're ready. Perfect. So we're going to take the cookie. I'm watching first. And your brush. <laughs> okay, this is sometimes a little okay. tricky for some people. You want to get a bunch of icing on your brush and do a little twirl so that it doesn't drip onto the edge of the cookie. And you want to get a few dollops of icing onto your cookie. And then you start pushing the icing around. It's really not painting in that you're not hitting the surface of the cookie. You're just gently pushing the icing around. Okay, so you keep filling in the different areas of the cookie, but you don't ever let the icing get thin. And I also try to cover the edge while I'm painting. It happens kind of automatically. Oh, you cover the I edge. I cover the edge, so then it becomes all of one piece. Yeah. You don't see you how see it was put edge. together. I really yeah. don't. And the like edge, that. but the mm -hmm. edge actually makes it a sharp edge. Exactly. What kind of brush is this? This is a real artist brush. It's a number 12. And um, it's kind of the perfect size for most cookies because it's got a nice point. You can get into detail spots. How's that? I missed a little spot. I missed a little spot. <laughs> a little spot. There you go. Perfect. So how long do these have to sit? Well, for them to be perfectly hard, I would let them sit overnight. Well, fortunately, I'm impatient, so Patty's brought some cookies that have been sitting overnight, so we can decorate them, right? I can't wait to see this part. Okay, this part is going to scare me. So something tells me that mine's going to look like a dog's dinner, and yours is going to look like art. Okay, what's next? Okay, we're going to make the black icing. Black icing. For That's outlining the... <laughs> so okay. we start with the white. Yeah. And we're going to give it a little stir, and then we're going to add the black food coloring. Oh, this is to outline the cookie so it gives it more pop when you see it. Oh, exactly. It'll really pop really and be crisp and fun. Stir it up. Wow, look at this. Looks like Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the consistency of the outline, not the flooding. Exactly. Okay. And right. I think this is perfect. So let's fill our tubes with the black icing. Okay. Wow. Close the top up again. Oh, Get that black down there. Okay, just gonna test mine out here. Perfect. Okay, we're ready to outline. Ready to go? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna start with this one. And you know, I'm gonna give it a little bit of a jaggedy line oh, to so make it, it looks look like fur. Exactly. Oh, good. Well, that's just... safer for me, too. Oh, that's fantastic. So you just wanna stay, you know, as close to the edge as you can. So once you get it all outlined, yeah. you're going to get into the fun details. Okay. So I'm going to start with the ear, and I kind of can see where it's going to be because the cutter sort of tells you. And I'm going to put the eye and the little black nose, and I think I'll give him a little tiny smile so he's a little happy. Oh, I love yours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the ear. The ear, anywhere around there. Okay. And you can make any sized ear you want. It can be a... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very big eye. <laughs> but it's working out. I like the shape. It is? Okay. Yes. And he has a nice smile. Because we like dogs that yeah. smile. <laughs> yeah, yours is happier than mine. Mine's, mine's really happy. And if you wanted to add a little spot somewhere, you could just, you know, go like that. And just fill it in? Yeah. Oh, I like that. Okay. I'm going to give him another little spot here. Okay, that looks great. What's next? I think we should give him each collar. Oh, I think so, too. Oh, is that what so the red is for? Yes. Okay, good. I'm going to do blue. Okay. You'll do red. So you're just going to start at the edge of the black and make a slightly curved line. And I'm going to actually double my line so its color's a little thicker. And there you go. And can I have Cute. a little hang tag on it? Yeah, I thought we could switch colors. Oh, great. You look fabulous. It's great. That's great. Thank you so much. I love my dog. Love yours better. Thank you, Patty. That was Thank so you. much fun. That was such fun. <laughs>
I just looks like a pedigree. Mine looks like a mutt, <laughs> but a lovable mutt. <laughs> I promise cookies all the time, and I'm sticking to my pledge with all your smart cookie questions in Ask Ina. Thank you.